Hello, uh, today I'm going to solve uh, 78 subsets. Let me read the problem. Uh, given a set of distinct integers nums, return all possible subsets, which is called the power set. Note uh, the solution uh, set must not contain duplicate subsets. Let's see the example. For nums 1 to 3, the output would be 3, 1, 2, 1 to 3, uh, 1, 3. 2, 3, 1, 2, and the empty subset. Okay, let's think about uh, what's the principle of getting all subsets. Let's see the diagram. For element 1, 2, 3, we can iterate sequentially from the beginning to the end. And then let's think about the choice behavior. For each element, we can do two behaviors, that is choice or not. We could know that this possible sequence of choice or not for each element is composing all possible subsets of this nums array. And we can use the recursive function to implement this behavior. Let's see the pseudocode. I implemented a comp function that is calling itself recursively. Index is increased by 1. And then the index reaches the nums size, the chosen array is added in answer vector. What's the difference between the two recursive function calls? Before calling the second combo function, we should add the current number in chosen array. This is the simulation of choice behavior. And the first combo function is called without adding the current number. This is the behavior of choose nothing. Okay, let's see the code. I first implemented this code exactly the same as the shooter code, but its performance is very slower. This code is just faster than the 9.77%. So what's the problem in this code? Actually, this code performs ON time complexity. Algorithm is not a problem. I could have found that the problem is chosen vector. This is always copying a chosen array through the recursive function call. So due to the copy operation, it performs very slower. So I improved this part. First I changed it. Sorry, I marked the wrong part. I changed the chosen array as a reference. And then we should add the pop operation after finishing the recursive function. This ensure at the end of count function, chosen set is recovered as received at the beginning of the function. So this code performs exactly the same as previous code in algorithm perspective, but it per performs much faster than before. This code is faster than 97.99%. Okay, thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.